The UP 200 unofficially kicked off tonight with the annual Mushers Banquet, and the shoot lineup is all set. With a sled banner from the Gwyn Sawyer Vet Clinic from Two Harbors, Minnesota, Troy Groenveld. Mushers were given their bib numbers tonight for the UP 200, Midnight Run, and Jack Pine 30 after enjoying dinner with fellow mushers. Mushers see the banquet as a way to catch up with their competitors, visit with volunteers, and to simply have a good time. The best part is seeing all old friends, a lot of the race volunteers, uh, the presidents, the board members, the vets, and all of our fellow uh, mushers that we don't, we don't get to see them that often. You know, they're up from all over the country, so we all meet together to, to race dogs, and it's nice to be able to come together and see them all again and visit. We as the musher, we, we stand on the sleds, we go out there, but a lot of us, especially myself, wouldn't get there without my handling crew, without the volunteers, without the race organization, things like that. So I just want to give a big shout out to them and give them a big thanks because without them, this wouldn't even happen. First time UP 200 musher Dietzen said her team is ready to tackle the weekend long race after participating in a few smaller races around the UP. We're as ready as we're going to get anyway. And uh, we did the Cine 300 earlier this uh, this year, and uh, I think that helped us prepare for this race quite quite a bit. And uh, I felt pretty confident going into that one, so I should be even more confident going into this one. <laughs> the UP 200 headquarters are in the Market YMCA, and there's a silent auction and merchandise booth set up for the weekend.